Hey everyone, welcome back to Mum's Eye View. So today I have two time saver meals that are perfect for when you have people around and you want something that not only looks good but tastes delicious too. So the first one we're going to make is the Pad Thai Vegetable Ribbon Salad. These are the ingredients that you're going to need. We have some bean sprouts, some cauldron marinated tofu pieces. We've got some coriander. Now this will split the nation because you either love or hate this. Any ingredients that you don't like, just skip out. Um, I've got some pickled onions that I've chopped. We've got some radishes that are going to add a little bit of heat. I'm going to slice these finely. We've got spring onions, some chilli, lime, um, carrots, courgettes, sweet chilli and also some reduced salt soy sauce. So this is seriously easy to make. The first thing that I'm going to do is just get some juice from a lime. So I'm just going to squeeze this into my juicer. I'm just going to use half a lime for this. I'm going to put that into a jug and then in there I'm going to put in a tablespoon of the reduced salt soy sauce. And also two tablespoons of the sweet chilli dipping sauce as well. Then just give that a really quick squeeze. So that is smelling so good. So we're going to move on to the next step, which is to simply put the bean sprouts into a pan of boiling water and just boil those for a couple of moments. So while those are boiling away, I'm just going to make ribbons with my courgettes and my carrots. What you want to do is just get a peeler and just simply just start shredding into ribbons like so. I think this one's going to need a fast forward. So we've got the beautiful carrot ribbons there. For the courgettes, we're just going to do the same thing, just chop off the ends. I'm leaving the skin on because I want a bit of contrast in colour. Then just again get your peeler. And what I find is if you peel one side first, then the ribbons are thicker. If you keep moving around, then the ribbons come quite thin like this. But I want some nice chunky pieces. So that's the courgettes done, I'm just going to toss them together just to mix up the colours a little bit and then I'm going to bring in the bean sprouts so I'm just going to drain them off first. Now these are still very warm so I'm just going to pop this aside and start finely chopping my radishes. These add such a nice pop of pink as well to contrast against the greens, the reds and also the orange too. So all that's left to do now is to put everything in here together. So I'm just going to add the radishes, the spring onions, give them a sprinkle, the chilies. Now I've got a whole chili and I haven't deseeded it because I do like my food quite spicy. Um, but if you want to deseed yours before you chop it up, then by all means. I'm going to add the pickled onions. And also about 100 grams of the marinated tofu. I'm going to put in a little bit of the coriander and then finish off with that gorgeous dressing. Then this is where you get your hands slightly dirty. So I'm just going to mix everything together just by tossing it all inside that dressing just so everything's nicely covered so you can see all the colours together this looks incredible and then what I'm going to do is just finish off with a little sprinkle of coriander just on the top so there you have it, your Pad Thai Vegetable Ribbon Salad, ready in 15 minutes and serves four. Looks absolutely incredible. And now we're going to move on to dish number two. So moving on to meal number two, which is incredibly simple. There's no chopping, there's no dicing, there's no peeling. 
it's just as easy as putting these things into a microwave. Now I'm going to show you another option because I don't have a microwave myself, but the meal we're going to be making today is sea bass with red pesto butter, if that doesn't sound special enough. We also have some tender stem broccoli, some sugar snap peas and spiralised veg. So if you just head over to the fishmonger section at your local Asda, sometimes they have these bags already made up. If not, it's just as simple as asking them to put in a couple of fillets for you with whatever butter you prefer. Um, these, as I say, these bags are microwavable. You can also put them in the oven. The instructions are on the back, so it makes it dead easy for you. If it's going into the microwave, you're looking at around three minutes, and I think you do have to pierce them. Mine's going in the oven, so it's going to take eight to 10 minutes um, so I'm going to go and preheat mine now. So whilst the fish cooks away, I'm going to move on to my veg. Now this is ridiculously simple. This is actually a steam in the bag vegetable selection from the Asda Extra Special range. So you can just pop this whole thing into a microwave for three minutes and then leave it to stand for one minute after it's finished. You must do that because the steam is extremely hot, so make sure you leave that for that minute before you open it. As I say, I don't have a microwave, so what I'm going to do is just open the bag and I've got it on the hob steamer. So just going to pour the contents in. It'll take a couple of moments more um, to do this on the hob. So I'm just going to put this on for around five minutes. So the fish is ready, the veg is ready, all that's left to do is to serve up. So when you take the fish first out of the oven, it will be quite swelled. Um, so just leave that for a minute or so, just to relax, just because you don't want all that hot steam going into your face. Then if you just take some scissors and just snip the top off. So I'm just placing this onto a sharing plate so that everybody can just help themselves and I'm going to make sure to get that delicious red pesto butter all over the fish. So I'm just going to take these straight from the pan into a bowl and these have still got all that crunch to them which is why I love steaming vegetables. So much colour in one bowl. So there you have it, your two time saver meals that not only look incredible and like you've spent ages in the kitchen cooking up a storm, but taste delicious too. You've got your pad thai vegetable ribbon salad, you've got your sea bass with red pesto and also your tender stem broccoli, sugar snap peas and spiralised veg. So I hope you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe to Mum's Eye View for more recipes and check out that description box below for more information. So thanks for watching guys, I'll see you soon.